Sorry, dinner's late. Would anyone like another drink? Oh, don't worry. It's nice to just sit a bit and socialize. You shouldn't have gone to all this trouble. With all your packing and whatnot, I imagine you have a lot on your plate. No pun intended. <laughs> Actually, there's been a change of plans. Oh? I, I thought maybe it was obvious, but April here's pregnant. <gasps> Congratulations! Oh. April, I can't tell you how pleased I am. Oh, but I expect you'll be needing a bigger house now, Hold won't you? Hold on a second, Ma. <laughs> Hold on a second, Ma. I, I don't get this. I mean, what's so obvious about it? I mean, uh, okay, she's pregnant, so what? Don't people have babies in Europe? Oh, Suppose we just say that people anywhere aren't very well advised to have babies unless they can afford them. Okay, okay, it's a question of money, money's a good reason, but it's hardly ever the real reason. What's the real reason? Wife talk you out of it or what? Little woman decides she isn't quite ready to quit playing house. No, uh, no, that's not it. I can tell she looks too tough and adequate as hell. Okay then, it must have been you. What happened? John, please, you're being very rude. No, no. What happened, Frank? You get cold feet. You decide you're better off here, after all. You figure it's more comfy here in the old hopeless emptiness, after all. Huh? Oh, wow. That did it. Look at his face. What's the matter, Wheeler? Am I getting warm? All right, son. I think we'd better... You know be... something? I wouldn't be surprised if he knocked her up on purpose just so he could spend the rest of his life hiding behind a maternity dress. That way he'd never have to find out what he's really made of. Now look! I think that's just about enough out of you. I mean, who the hell do you think you are? You come in here and say whatever crazy goddamn thing comes into your head, and I think it's about time somebody told you to keep your goddamn mouth shut. It's not well, Frank. Not well, my ass! I don't give a damn if he's sick or well or dead or alive. He should keep his fucking opinions in the fucking insane asylum where they belong! Let's go, son. Come on, John. Big man you got there, April. Big family man. I feel sorry for you. Still, maybe you deserve each other. I mean, the way you look right now, I'm beginning to feel sorry for him too. You must give him a pretty bad time if making babies is the only way he can prove he's got a pair of balls. You fucking- No! He's not well, Frank! All right, John. Let's get on out to the car now. April, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, right. Sorry. Sorry! Sorry! Oh, 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 my! Have I said I'm sorry enough times? Damn! I am sorry, too. I've had, I'm just about the sorriest bastard I know. But get right down to it. I don't have a whole hell of a lot to be glad about. Do I? Oh, but hey. You know what? I am glad about one thing. You want to know what I'm glad about? I'm glad I'm not going to be that.